In this video, I will be becoming that girl for a day and attempting to become the best version of myself. Enjoy! Hey you guys, good morning! So I just thought that I would like sit down and kind of explain to you guys what this video is going to be about for those of you who may not know. So this video I'm going to be attempting or trying to become that girl. So when you think of that girl, you think of drinking lemon water, eating healthy, just journaling, everything of that sort. So that is basically kind of what this video is going to persist of. Becoming that girl in my opinion is like becoming a healthier version of yourself or like your ideal healthy version of yourself so like it's basically like a healthy hot girl summer you know you know basically like taking care of yourself i'm pretty sure most of you guys probably know about this tiktok trend it's also trending on youtube currently and me personally i came into it from youtube i got this video idea from michaela amari and like when i seen her video i was just like yes like we're like become the healthier version of yourself this is both a tiktok and youtube trend there is like positive comments about it and then there is also negative comments about it so I was like, why not let me try this trend out and get my opinion on it? You know, because honestly, everybody has different opinions. Some people think that the trend is not realistic, which if you could wake up every morning and like continuously, wherever you wake up, get up, make your bed, do all that. I literally like applaud you. Like for me, honestly, I would not be, <laughs> I would not be able to wake up every morning, get up, do that, do that, do that. But that is why I'm trying out this trend. I hope that kind of like gives a good enough explanation on it. This love ain't nothing but a thing to me, yeah. This love ain't nothing but a thing to me, yeah. Okay. Hold on. I don't know if it looks like I did nothing, but I just did an ab workout, you know, for abs. And I'm completely tired and like, Right here hurts. I think it's supposed to, but ow. Wow. I don't know, but I kind of want to do a new, another one. Like I feel like, I feel like yeah, like I'm tired and stuff, but I feel like I'm not like complete with my workout. You know, like I'm not like. Well, I don't want to be hot and sweaty, but you know, like I feel like when you're finished with your workout, you're supposed to feel like you're finished. I feel like I just. <laughs> fell on something stomach first like basically i'm just not content with my workout you know so i think i'm gonna find another one and then i'll probably do that okay so i am finished my workout i did an ab workout and a full body workout and now i'm kind of tired <laughs> So, um, working out is something that I would love to do. I don't want to say every week, but at least, like, maybe one day a week, you know? I definitely wouldn't do all seven days, and I want to say two days out of the week. Working out is something that I would like to do more. I feel like it's just good for your body, and it helps you, like, keep up with your body a little bit. On to the next thing, which is a nice shower. <laughs>
guys so who's the last time i think the last time i talked to you guys was when i was working out and since then i've taken a shower did a little skincare and made breakfast well afternoon snack because giving what time i woke up time kind of started flying by my intention was definitely to wake up really really early but that just wasn't the case and honestly you know i'm kind of okay with that so yeah this is actually like tasting so good right now I got this from Publix. I think you can get it from Walmart too. So after I finish breakfast, I will journal. To be honest, literally every morning I don't even make a breakfast for myself. My typical breakfast would probably have to be maybe cereal. It's very rare that I have cereal, but recently I've been eating a lot of cereal. Literally any leftovers like spaghetti, something of that sort. So yes. But I definitely want to look into having a healthier schedule, you know. Eat more fruits and stuff like that because I don't not eat fruits. Okay, so let's just put it this way. This is um junk food and this is healthy food. I'm like, I can't even say in the middle, like I'm literally running that way. <laughs> like it's crazy how much I eat junk food, which is not okay. So far with this video, or just this day, this morning, me waking up early and getting up is just like the most amazing feeling towards the end because it makes the day feel so much longer. Like I feel like I've done so much and it's only 151. <laughs> too short i doubt it will be too long why are you blurry okay finally we're focused i definitely you know enjoy filming this video and trying out the trend is this something that i would do every day i mean maybe not every day because you know sometimes we just have those days when we just want to completely shut up and don't do nothing for the day so i <laughs> but most of the time i have those days every day but if it's not every day then i will wake up early but i won't do the whole 360 get up do this do that do that workout push-ups now no, I won't do that. To be honest, I only do maybe like two or three of the things on the list. Yeah, my opinion on it, it was definitely fun. Um, I feel like it was like more of like a, I kind of would say self-care because like working out, eating healthy, skincare, you know, things like that. That's like giving very much self-care. Yeah, like I said, it was definitely fun. My opinion on it, I kind of like disagree with saying like that it's toxic because if you're used to doing it and it becomes a habit, there's nothing really like unrealistic about it, you know? I definitely kind of also understand when people say that this trend is kind of like it promotes fitness and it promotes like being healthy and stuff like that and I feel like I don't really know how everyone is but I know that before quarantine I was kind of active I wasn't really active I'm not even gonna lie I was lazy then and I'm still lazy now <laughs> quarantine just made me like extra lazy and I feel like this trend is kind of like boosting getting out of that kind of and like do this do that I don't know if you guys understand what I'm trying to say I don't know how to explain it well enough so that to make sure that you guys understand I don't think it has nothing to do with anything but just becoming a better version of yourself so yeah that was my opinion on this video like i said i really enjoyed filming it i tried to give my little opinion because like everybody has different opinions what do we say when we're about to get out this video you guys better complete my heart did you complete my heart bestie because you complete it now we're getting out of the video what do we say when we're about to get out this video i will see you guys in my next video Bye! Hey.